Hello YouTube and welcome to another episode of Let's Build an Egyptian Temple. So we got quite a lot done, also there was quite a lot um, cut out of the episodes. Hopefully we won't have any more of those issues. Let me just check here. That was my gods. Okay, so it's been like two or three weeks since I recorded an episode of this and I kind of forgot where I was up to. Um, this episode what we're going to be doing is planning out the next section of the temple. So this was like the grand entrance, the pylons they were called. And next we have a big, large, pillared courtyard. Um, the courtyard was used during festivals for like, markets and stuff like that. Uh, it was also just like a general gathering place. Um, so I'm actually just going to quickly check whereabouts the walls go up to. I think it's roughly about here, you know, quite close to the edge of the pylon. Uh, I'm just going to have a look at a couple pictures and get an idea and then we'll be back. Yeah, so that was quite simple. It was quite close to the edge i was just checking in case maybe it was in the center but you know then that would be a bit off so we also want to think about the pillars that we're going to use so if we have this here we're going to have we could either have single block pillars which i think are going to look very small in comparison uh, we could have the two thick pillars like i've got over there i think we'll go for the two thick pillars so we're going to go five blocks from that edge maybe which will be here and five blocks from this wall this wall i'm also going to make three blocks thick so if we do five blocks that's three four five so the first pillar is going to go there five blocks away from that pillar we'll have another one that's four not five there we go uh, maybe five blocks away from that one we go here so that actually fits quite nicely uh leaves us to the door pretty good so let's do another five blocks so one two three four five one two three four five one two three four five. i think i've miscounted somewhere yep here i need to bring it in by one and here i need to bring it in by two is that right now nope god damn it okay so there's a couple of pillars that we've got there um is that enough pillars? That's nowhere near enough pillars, is it? So let's do six, I think. I think six seems like a good number. So, the... Uh, that's five. This will be six. And let's just do seven. For the sake of odd numbers. So there you go, we've got our line of seven. So now we can work on the outer wall so i'm going to do slash one that gets me the world edit axe and we're just going to go along here like this like that oh also i forgot to mention um if you haven't already watched the lake town video uh, in the first couple of minutes of the late time video, I'd appreciate if you watch. Um, I do talk about... Uh, what's the word? Talk about some ideas for the channel of like multi-uploads a day. You know, like uploading two or three episodes of one video, like one series. So um, check that out if you guys think it's a good idea. Let me know. Um, yeah, that's the main thing. I talk about the reasons why and stuff. In more detail in the first two three minutes of that video so go check that out if you're interested if you think it's a good idea comment below in this video um if you don't think it's a good idea comment below in this video i want to hear both sides of the argument um i personally think it's gonna be a good idea but if people are happy with just the one then you know we don't need it do we so uh, right walls 24 that should be sandstone and i've kind of messed it up a little bit only by one block so we'll just do undo and we'll do undo r because i can't type let's see we're gonna go here ah oh, god damn it i right clicked right click by accident so now we've got to fly all the way back over here to right click <sighs> right click walls 24 there we go and we're going to come in a block, right click, 
go all the way over here and left click walls 24 there we go it's looking good and we're also going to copy this column and just paste that over so we'll be back when i've done that okay so here we are we've got our pillars sort of pasted in place roughly laid out uh, i am thinking there's a few too many pillars so what i'm going to do is remove these ones so we're going to have like the two here and set zero so now we've got like a line of two around all the sides and i think that looks quite nice you've definitely got place for market stalls which i said it's going to be during the festival times so i'm actually going to try that um so we're going to have those market stalls actually in when we actually get to finishing and detailing off i also need to check this i have a feeling it's not centered which is going to annoy me and it's off by a block oh bloody hell i've done it i've done it right <laughs> by some miracle i got it right first time okay so um how tall do we want these pillars well i don't think they need to be too tall maybe half the height of this we'll work on a group of four and then we'll just do some copy and pasting um so we're just going to build it up to a nice height and then we'll start detailing the pillars and stuff like that um three more blocks higher i think one two three one two three one two three one two three that seems a decent height maybe another block now another thing that i've read about them is that they try to make the pillars look like pine not pine palm trees um copy and paste i think it's palm trees anyway basically they um they come out near the top like this i'm not sure how well it's going to translate in minecraft we'll give it a go uh but i don't think it's going to work very well so we're going to do that same here as well it's named after a specific type of tree and i forgot the name of the tree now um but it's from the palm tree family anyway uh so that's okay some stirs as well and we're just going to do this 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 this, 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 this. there we go the insides doesn't look too bad it does look a bit weird because it's minecraft and it's blocks it's not really a lot we can do about that uh oop mr block two go there two go there Come on, there we go. That's okay. I think I need to look more at some of these pillars to get an idea. Um, I'm really not organised with this series, I've realised. Um, it seems like every episode I'm like, oh, let's go look at this, let's go look at something, let's go look at something. But, you know, it's kind of, it, it's good, because, you know, it's showing that I actually do quite a lot of research. See, that's helped to smooth it out, but then when I look from this angle, it's not going to look as nice. If I try to copy it over... It's not going to look as rounded. Right? Actually, it kind of does. Maybe we can get away with that. It is a bit top heavy. All right, I'm just going to look at some pictures of the pillars and get an idea of the different designs and see which one I like most, and we'll work on a new design. So I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I think I've got quite a few ideas. Another thing we also need is a roof along where these pillars are. So I'm going to just bring these across to about here and then bring this up as well. To the right click left click right click clicking 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 uh see how much of an overhang do we want this is one block enough or do we want two block i think we'll go for two block overhang for now and just see how it looks bring this out to about here right click set 24 so they're very very top heavy because I've gone for an even number, it's going to look very, very odd. I'm also going to add some feet to the bottom of the pillar. Something that I've noticed. Um, so, in here. Also, somebody commented saying, am I going to do sort of the stories, uh, like, that are painted on the walls on the inside of the temples. I'm going to try. But I'm not going to make any promises. It's going to be quite hard to achieve in Minecraft. Uh, I can give it a go, but, you know, it's going to be on such a large scale that it's not going to look 
right, I don't think. But we'll give it a go, we'll see. Um, I think that looks a bit better, doesn't it? That's what we'll go for. That That's the design I'm kind of happiest with. I'll just try lowering this a bit more. Okay, so I did a little bit off camera. <laughs> uh, it was mainly just copy and pasting job. Um, we've just sorted a design that I'm happy with, copied it and pasted it around, and I did the roof. Now, I'm also thinking that this roof should be slanted slightly. Uh, you know, like the Roman um, slab roof that people do in Minecraft, that type of thing, and made out of wood um, with a nice little pattern. Uh, I'll explain that more in another episode. Uh, this episode has been more sort of planning and getting the ideas right. The next episode is going to be detailing the pillars, doing the walls. This is where the uh, story idea is going to come from. So I'm going to try and do something along these walls to do a picture of a story. It's going to be quite hard to do, I think, in Minecraft. But we'll, we'll find a way to do it. Um, and then... Once the courtyard is done, hopefully by the end of the next episode, maybe two episodes on the detail, um, then we'll be able to work on the next section of the temple, which the next section is the inner courtyard. It's another pillared room, very similar to this one. Um, I can't really remember what else goes in there except for pillars. Kind of just like a thing. There we go. Good. Um... Yeah, and then after that you have the main sanctuary, so we're getting, doing quite a lot of progress on this. It's looking quite nice. I also need to smooth out the back, but I'll probably just do that off camera as well. It's not really a big thing that you guys need to see. Um, that's it for this episode though, guys. Next episode will be detailing this courtyard. Don't worry about the uh, materials as well, the grass. I will be changing that. I do want this temple up on a slight hill at some point, so I'm going to move that over into the corner of the plot once it's done. Hopefully it's not getting too big. Where's the edge of the plot? This is a pea grand plot, so we should have plenty of space. Ah, right, we've got loads of space. The temple's probably going to be the length of the plot, but we have got space to do it. Uh, on the other side, we're going to have a pyramid. Um, we're going to have like a bit of a river for a ship or two. And then the main city. Uh, this is going to eventually become let's build an Egyptian city instead of let's build an Egyptian temple. But I thought I'd just split it up into little mini-series. I'm going to do this, I'm going to do the pyramid, and then we'll just do the city in one big go. Because they're the main features of the city. So once they're done, um, I think I'll be quite happy and we can move on. Um, don't forget to go check out the Lake Town video if you haven't already. Uh, comment below about whether you think it's a good idea to do multiple videos a day. Uh, I just don't want people to get lost you know with videos to forget where they're up to and stuff but yeah so depends on who's got free time and who hasn't that's it for this episode guys don't forget to like comment subscribe all that fun stuff and i'll see you guys in the next one